design robotics, we have been working on basic code, taking the engineering, the design process, and engineering and looking at planning and ways to use robots. Students have been using the district just purchased for us in our classes, um, Sphero Bolts, and the, they have endless opportunities. So what we've done is we've made a plan and doing distance over time and averaging it out. And um, they have used block code and then line code to plan out routes and try to build on an XY axis ways to maneuver their bolt. And uh, we will be building activities and challenges for them. They have done a fabulous job. We have groups that take their math and their plan right to the Sphero and it works just about exactly the first time. That's impressive. Take a look at this. Oh, we're oh trying to program the Sphero to make it from the start. Let's get this in the middle. To the end. So and it's pretty hard. We've been on it for a while. Winning on much? He's gonna hit that wall. Winning run. Winning run much? He's gonna hit that wall. Winning run. Okay, yeah, this sounds way better. Oh, it's last time. He's got a chance. Um, we had to start our Sphero here, and we made it to the 4, and made it stop, and then go down to the 6, turn, 90 degrees, and then stop on the paper behind there. We are trying to get our Sphero to go straight forward and then turn at an angle where it can go from one point to like a point over there, you know, because that makes sense. And then for our blocks, we have one block that goes straight and then we have it delay for two seconds and then we have it go at a 111 degree angle and we've tried many times but we think we finally got it this time. Awesome.